Well, Graham Bonnet, welcome to Australia. Welcome to the uh, Yarra River. And I moved. Yeah, well, thank you very much. We've picked a lovely day for it. Oh, well, well, yeah, yeah. It um, is really good. How are you feeling? You re recuperated yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> a few late nights, I've heard, over the past few days. Slightly, yeah. A yeah. lot of late nights. A lot of late nights. Yeah. Well, we can get on to a um, get to know about Graham Bonnet type conversation because a lot of people really don't know all that much about you. It's it's mainly with uh, It's All Over Now Baby Blue that your, your popularity and, and just general knowledge of you has started to happen in Australia. <coughs> but yeah. you're, not, you're not really a newcomer, are you? Uh, not really, no, no. I used to be with a band called The Marbles in about 68. And um, my cousin, who is uh, a guy called Trevor Gordon, used to be with the Bee Gees over here. And we formed a band called The Marbles. Uh, Barry Gibb wrote the songs for us. We had a, a couple of hits over here and in New Zealand, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that ended after two years because my cousin didn't like the uh, music business anymore. So now he's a school teacher. Well, at that stage, too, you started looking at, at things other than the uh, the music industry as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it didn't want me anymore. <laughs> it threw me out, music it, business. So I was going to be um, a holiday camp... Uh, that sounds bad, doesn't it? Holiday camp. Do you know Butlin's holiday camps? Well, we've in heard England. of we've heard of the um, you know, all that sort of business. the holiday camps from Carry On This and Carry On That. They're yeah, always in holiday I was going to work in one of those. You know, as a sort of a an entertainer and uh, whatever. You know, I'm glad I didn't do it. I'm glad because uh, I had a telegram from my manager. His name is David Ollie. When I went home. Uh, it's about uh, two years ago. I had this telegram from from David and said, "What are you doing, Graham? Please get back into the music business." And so I came back. Yeah. Here I am now. You know. You were exper experimenting for a certain while with movies as well, too. Uh, I had a go. Yeah, a film called Three for All, which was a terrible film. It was a sort of a comedy thing, uh, like a Cliff Richard film gone wrong <laughs> Ooh, oh yes <laughs> nice film <laughs> here comes summer holiday uh, I like uh, I like to I like to uh, do a bit of acting but uh, it wasn't a very good film you also got yeah. got off the um, the James Dean role in a movie too didn't you yeah but that fell through for some reason because uh, they started drawing back uh, James Dean films on TV, et cetera, et cetera, back home in England. I don't know why this was, but uh, for some reason it fell through. So I don't know what happened there. But maybe there's a thing next year, another James Dean thing. Yeah. We'll see about that. So, so you're still entertaining thoughts about uh, about movies as well? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like to have a go. Yeah. It's, uh, it's good fun. And not necessarily in a musical role? No, no, no. Just straight Straight, out. yeah. Yeah. I suppose you would have been pretty surprised about the success of the album in Australia compared to the rest of the world. I am very surprised. I mean, it didn't happen in England. Had a go, but it didn't quite happen. But it's a nice surprise. And uh, yesterday I got this uh, gold thing presented to me on a show uh, called Countdown. Yeah. And that's great. Jesus, what do you do with your flights here? I, I, there's lots of them. There. <laughs> but compared to the rest of the world, you're sort of surprised that it actually happened in Australia oh, yeah. before it happened more It happened here less. more Anywhere, you know, yeah. this is it for me, you know. What about an Australian tour? You've been thinking about that at all? <coughs> yeah, next May. And I hope to use the same guys I used on the album if I can get them. But they're very busy at the moment. We have a date even, May the 5th, I think. Is that a That's definite or a... Uh... Oh, well, I hope so. You hope so? I, I want to come back. Yeah. I really want to come back because it's a nice place. <laughs> in, bet in between now and then, obviously, there's more recording to be done. Another yeah. album or what? Yeah. When I go back home, uh, we start recording December the 5th on the new album. I've got to listen to a lot of material when I get home, new songs, etc., etc., etc. And uh, that should be out early next year, here. Well, we should wait and see what happens when that happens, huh? <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get back into some more Australian beer. Yes, all right. And some English music. Graham, thanks very much. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>